Irishman one day. As the streets were paved with gold, sure everyone was gay. Singing songs of Piccadilly Strand in Leicester Square. On a cold winter's morning, she was sitting there. She was a young woman, thinking only about a sweetheart so far away from her. And here in the Irish countryside, surrounded by fields that were filled with rocks, she'd received his letter. She knew it was from him. The fine writing, the beautiful copper plate way that he had written, it was so neat. And he always made jokes about the way that it wasn't he who made the spelling mistakes, it was the pen. And he wrote about how there she was, there he was in the, in the middle of London, telling everybody how fine it was. But Tipperary was where his heart really lay. She had to go out and feed the animals on her mother's farm. This was the place that they were going to go to when he returned from the war. This war that was going to end all wars and be over by Christmas. And she waited every day. She would place that blanket around her shoulders to keep herself warm. And when she placed it against her nose, she could tell that he had lain down upon it. And she would smile and think about him, telling everybody how fine it was to be back in Ireland. And she waited and she waited. And the war came to an end and nothing was heard of him. And one day she was sitting inside of a cinema. She saw news reports, movies from the war. And she saw him there, she saw him there on the battlefield, smiling, smiling, so far away from home and far from her heart. And she would go to the cinema every day that they showed that newsreel, every day for a week, a fortnight, a month, just so she could get a glimpse of a sweetheart who had died in the war. to his Irish Molly O Show he not receive it Write and let me know If I make mistakes in spelling Molly dear said hey Remember it's the pen that's bad Don't lay the blame on me